Hello friends welcome back to my channel. Since Arrow's series finale in 2020, the former Spartan and Oliver Queen's right-hand man has been touted as having been found worthy of joining the ranks of the Green Lanterns, and many fans are wondering if the subplot will ever pay off. Many people are also wondering if John Diggle would join the cast of the upcoming Green Lantern Corps series on HBO Max. Despite teasing that position for John Diggle since Arrow's finale, Stairgirl just revealed the first incarnation of Green Lantern in the Arrowverse. Jenny, an orphan who was kicked out of the orphanage she grew up in with just two bequests from her father, Alan Scott. A toy car belonging to her brother, Todd, and an emerald ring fashioned like a lantern, was the subject of the second episode of Stairgirl Season 2. When Jenny put the ring on, it began to shine and led her to Courtney Whitmore's house, where she found the Green Lantern's lantern and other JSA mementos. Jenny had absorbed the lantern's power by the end of the episode, revealing herself as a living conduit for the power her father harnessed as the Green Lantern. Because her father was mentioned in Stairgirl Season 1 but never seen in action, this makes Jenny who is also known as Jade in the comics, the first on-screen Green Lantern in the Arrowverse. While it may appear that fans of John Diggle and Arrow are being trolled at this point, it is unlikely that there is anything more sinister going on than faulty timing, which is most likely due to the pandemic's shooting constraints. Something significant is in the works for John Diggle's character, as actor David Ramsey does not appear to have any further projects lined up other than a cameo in one of Supergirl's last episodes, which he is also directing. While many fans had hoped that Diggle might return to the Green Lantern core series, nothing has been announced as of yet. The most likely explanation is that the concept of officially establishing John Diggle as a Jon Stewart variant clashed with rights concerns surrounding the long-delayed Green Lantern core film which is still apparently in production independently of the HBO Max series. There was nothing stopping Stairgirl from adapting Jade for live action first, making her the first wielder of the Green Flame to appear on screen in the Arrowverse, if not the first member of the Green Lantern Corps. For John Diggle, we will have to wait a little more before we actually get to know what will happen to his Green Lantern. Meanwhile, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you soon.